We play. We fight. We conquer. Welcome to The Freak Show. I'm your host, Bumpy McSquiggums, and today we get to dive in and check out Warhammer Age of Sigmar Stormground. It is by Gasket Games and Focus Home Interactive, releasing on May 26th, 2021. Big shout out and a thank you for sending the code my way, and we're going to dive in and begin. I literally just installed this. We're going to hope the computer holds out, and we're going to give it a shot, folks. New computer is on its way. This one is dying a slow and painful death. Hopefully, it's got enough in it to continue to uh, keep us going here. So we have Stormcast Eternals, we have the Night Haunt, and we have the Maggot Kin of Nurgle. But as it stands right now, we only have the, the warrior. The Stormcast Eternals are mortal heroes that have been remade into godlike warriors in the forges of Azir. Each the embodiment of Sigmar's storm. They are the God King's wrath made manifest, and they were created for one single purpose. Outright war! Sounds like fun. You shall die in the battles ahead, and that is not just certain, it is expected. Take courage, dying is not to fail, but to be reforged to fight again and again. Only the war is eternal. Stormcast Eternals Campaign Warrior Ascension. Limited starting warband. Revives. Cost one miracle per squad. Single realm conquest. Let's get into it and let's get this going. We're going to Thanator's Mance Shyish. Okay. I'm not real sure what we're going to be getting ourselves into here, but I'm here for it. Shyish. Realm of Death. A place of finality and endless decline. There resides Thanator's Mats, a stronghold long thought to be unassailable. It teems with frenzied night haunt spirits, cursed to linger there by Nagash himself. It is here the tide turns for the God King's faithful. The stars themselves have been read, and they have revealed to Sigma. A champion, Freya Skyhelm, a Lord Celestant, loyal and lion-hearted. Like the Mance itself, Freya bears deep scars of Nighthaunt malice, but she will stand tall and thunder on you, whether it be with vengeance or valiance in her heart, only Sigma knows. That's fantastic, by the way. Very nice. Alright. Well, let's hope this all works out. Still struggling with the PC, folks. I actually had to restart this recording and piece it together, so we'll see. Oh, boy. Turn back, traveler! The dead forgive no trespasses! Now nah, I'm good. Foul ghouls! Tormentors of my dreams! I will have vengeance. Yeah. All right, what am I doing? Ooh, next turn, Stormcast Eternals. Move the cursor to highlighted hexes. Move the, to the cursor and highlight hexes. Moving to the cursor. Moving to the cursor to the edge. Moving the cursor to the edge of the screen will also move the camera. All right, press the left mouse button to select Freya. Sky Helm, and then press again on the valid hex to move her, and then you can press the right click to deselect at any time. Oh, this is great. Alright. Well, I mean, I suppose that makes the most sense. Charge over off. here. And then we can end our turn. When all of your moves are complete, you can hit the enter button to end your turn at any time. Well, can I retaliate or attack or something? No? Well, I guess maybe I made a mistake there. Alright. Okay, I got a good counterattack on that one. That wasn't too bad. I'm gonna move within range, but not actually attack. Alright, damage slash armor. When a unit takes damage, the amount inflicted is reduced by the value of the defender's armor stat. Freya's current armor value is 2. Man, the music is real loud. If a unit's armor stat is greater or equal to the damage, an armor save may trigger, resulting in no damage taken. 
The higher the armor value is versus the damage, the greater likelihood an armor save will occur. When a unit moves to a hex that is occupied by an enemy unit, that move becomes a charge. To initiate a charge, select Freya and press the left mouse button on a valid enemy to target. Units take retaliatory damage from the defenders when they charge. However, if the defender dies from the initial charge damage, no retaliatory strike can be taken. Good, I like that. However, at this point, we're not able to charge. We're just going to have to straight up merc this guy right here. Alright, so we've moved there. Be gone, Shadow! Haunt my knights no more! Indubitably. Can I attack you as well? Nope, oh, doesn't seem like it. Well, that, is a, that is a piercing sound, isn't it? Just kind of shrugged off most of the attacks there. Hammer slam, and we also challenge. Force target to charge your position. Range units will fire upon you, but are interrupted. Huh. Or I can just click on you and just take you out. Alright, right, that's fine. The Seems fine is anyway. This is no dream. This is waking. Last I recall, I was cast from High Azir to the realm of Shaish, and then I lost myself. The trauma of my reforging lingers still. Well, that seems bad. All right. Breach the Thanator's manse and slay the gatekeepers. Okay, I did adjust the volume there, guys and gals. Um, I, I guess we're gonna end our turn? Oh, cool, more guys spawn. That's great. Those pyres draw the wayward dead to defend the manse. The castigators are here. Oh, but we also have our own. Crew. Castigators reporting. Did you leave any glory for the rest of the Brotherhood, Lord Celestant? Yes. Yes, we did. Nay, sisters. There's no glory to be had here. Only vengeance. Our target is those pyres. If we destroy them. Victory is ours! Sweet. Castigators are ranged units that attack their targets from a distance. They cannot charge and do not take retaliatory damage when attacking. Nice. With your castigators selected, left click on a valid enemy target to initiate a ranged direct attack on it. Alright. Not too bad. Sigmars to command. I guess I'll move here, and we'll just end our turn. Aether and abilities. Aether is a resource used to cast active abilities. Once, or one of Freya's active abilities is challenge. Challenge is a useful ability for drawing enemies away from weaker units like castigators. If used on these chain rasp hordes, they will be forced to move from their position to charge Freya, taking retaliatory damage for their trouble. To experiment with challenge, select Freya and then select the challenge from her ability bar. Then select a target enemy within range. Hmm. I mean, I'd like to do that, but at this Just point... Give us a target. Can we step back and still attack? Immediately. What's this? Indirect attack after chain lane, target attacks. Our way. So you can either move or attack. You can't move and attack, it looks like. Alright, I guess we're gonna... in Sigmar's name. Can, can I cancel that? Because I done made a mistake. That is not where they're gonna be at. I forgot that you step forward when you take over a spot. Well, mistakes were made, I suppose. We need to actually lay into the skull pyre. Because we're getting kind of beat down here. Quite heavily, to be honest. I mean, it looked good for for a few seconds. Who would you castigate? And then it looked much less good. Alright, so we've done that. We're gonna go over here and we're gonna attack this. I will not fail again. 
kind of getting beat up. This is actually kind of tough to, to really figure out exactly what we can do here to make this work. Because another one's going to spawn before we're ready. attack here. I, mean, I don't know if she's going to have like an ability to actually heal or what. Oh, that's not where they're supposed to be at at all. I totally misread that situation. I feel like it was a good, it was a good effort. I feel like it was a good effort, but... The most accurate in his ear. Why did I move? I could have just attacked from the, the hex I was in. That made no sense to me. And then she got knocked down. The castigators are going to have a bad time. A little bit strange. I'm, I'm starting to kind of get a feel for it. I oh, see they were able to... Oh, God. They were able to straight up wreck us there. That was not good. Alright, so we obliterated them. We're going to use our challenge ability. Call them over. Your blows will not stop my justice. And I I suppose we just attack and finish them. Arcane, brethren. Rough stuff. If we don't get like some way of healing real soon, we're gonna have a real hard time. Let us press on! Uh, knockback uh, mm -hmm. not really helpful we go all right I guess we move here and then we uh, try to fire there makes the most sense maybe hey nope Magic to the they dodged us again that's pretty good Huh. That sucked. For great justice. Channeled ordinance cost. So that did no damage. Well, I mean, I, I'm learning. I'm learning how different things work. She is real close to going down, and then we're gonna hit her with the channel. Down they go. That gives us a little tiny bit of leeway, maybe. Where we could maybe attack. Well, nope, we still can't even attack. In Sigmar's name. Oh my goodness. This is so Shadow terrible for me. Alright, well, I guess we're gonna attack right there. In hopes that that's where they spawn in at. Nope, they didn't spawn in at all. Okay, so I guess we've. I bring the we survived it. I will press forward. Castigators ready. Still not quite strong enough. We did it, we're heroes. Can we like heal now? Is that a possibility? Because I feel like healing would be fantastic. We've secured the gates. Ooh. The God King's divine will is clear. The liberation of Thanator's Mance commences. Yeah, it's a mistake. And so me. does my own redemption. Sigmar willing. Victory! I'll take it. Okay, I kind of have a rough idea what's going on. So we have castigators now. Two, one, four, two. Not real sure what all of that means just yet. So there's still quite a bit that I don't quite fully grasp, but that's okay. We can expect it, or inspect it, I suppose. Huh. How long has it been since Phantom Steel bit into me? The Skyhelm Saga one. There's four pages to this? Or it's one of four. Braving the blighted realm of Skyish gives me purpose. It is true, but it carries no joy with it. 
How long has it been since Phantom Steel bit into me fighting in uh, Gry in Gyran's depths? I'm sure I'm pronouncing that totally accurately, like I do everything else. Now I come to the realm of the horror that once slew me. The pain of my reforging lingers still. Even that is nothing compared to the pain of losing Cobalt. Is that a blessing or a curse? I know it is not my place to decide. I have my duty to perform. For the good of the mortal realms, that is enough. I will lead my new Stormcast Brotherhood, named in my honor, and together we will strike down the per perfidious spirits infesting Thanator's manse. Then, Sigmar willing, I will know something of a warrior's rest, at least for a short while. Interesting. All right, Freya, Skyhelm, Lord Celestant. And we got a little bit of experience there. All right. So we started here. We have completed that. Now we're moving on to the West Battlements, where we must destroy all enemies. A procession of ghasts is entrenched in the West Battlements. Put them to rest. Enemy Warband. Skill Uncommon and Tank Class Common. Looks like we'll be looking at some new uh, units here. Every warband must have one hero. Your hero occupies the top slot of your warband. Select this slot to add a new unit to your warband. Alright, well we got our castigators. Yep. War spoils from your victories on the field can be seen here. Uh, add units, ge war gear, skills, divine axe, and lore to your horde. Lore journals provide background information on characters and other details you will encounter in your storm ground or in storm ground. Uh huh. Okay. Well, so. Braving the blighted oh, realm of shite. All right, we already did that. I read it not nearly as well as she would have, but it's okay. You strengthened your warband. Take to the battlefield to showcase your new strength. Well... Cast me <sighs> to the field. I will Ooh. be your light in the darkness. Your lightning bolt of retribution. Sounds good to me. Seems less good now that I... Every battle begins by summoning your hero from your warband to the battlefield. Select Freya Skyhelm from the warband. And select a valid hex to summon her to the battlefield. Uh-huh. Oh, oh, I, I, wait, what? Did I? Oh, right, okay. I got By it, the I got lightning, it. I am here! Okay, now what? Power is a resource used to summon additional units from your warband. You'll earn an increasing amount of power per turn. Unspent power is converted to aether at the end of your turn. Spend your three power to summon a squad of castigators from your warband. Select the castigators from your warband and select a valid hex to summon. <laughs> castigators, right. take the high ground. The slope may slow us, but once it is ours, we can strike down the enemy from greater ranges. Sure. Sounds good to me. The path is clear. I assume the castigators can't move on the same turn. But they get spawned or summoned. A war chest and lore cash bless this battlefield. I shall secure each in your name, Lord Sigmar. Sweet. Castigators standing by. We have better firing range at this vantage. Yes, yes, we're aware. We we've been told this, thank you, castigators. We never would have guessed otherwise. Uh, there's a medium chance that they go there. Four spoils. What is it? What 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 is it? These war spoils will aid our cause. Earn war gear, skills, or even new units to equip to your warband by collecting war chests and winning battles. Warbands can only be changed between battles on the warband menu. After the battle is won, be sure to review and equip your new war spoils before starting the next battle. Makes sense. Alright, you went that way, and you went right into our trap. Very nice. Kind of glad that worked out, actually. Um, take you out. And 
I definitely want to go over there and claim that, but I don't think I can. The time is now. Does I have no choice but to smack this Do guy? Alright, well, we'll end our turn. I assume you're going to move over and attack the castigators. You're unable to. Who should be castigated? I am Sigmar's to command. We definitely want the lore cash, so we're going to try to get to it. There's a lot of haunted folk over this way. Let us press on! They do not seem too happy that we exist. We're going to move here. We're going to go ahead and we're going to shoot there because they're probably going to move that direction is my assumption. Let's see. Oh, frenzied. Seems super upset. They did not move where I thought they were going to. Still, it was a decent questionable shot. All right, we got two items collected, and now we have to hope that we don't get got. A gut. cache of law to be studied after the battle is won. Uh-huh, 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 you say this. You have collected a lore cache transcribed within as a piece of the ancient histories of Shyish, the realm of death. There are many more pieces of lore to collect scattered across the battlefields of the realms. You can study the lore you have collected between battles by reviewing the lore tab on the War Spoils menu. Uh-huh, I'm all over it. I don't like it. They really want the advancing in Sigmar's name. They really want the castigators. Who would you castigate? Redeploying. Like a lot. Like they really want them. Magic. Oh, this might go badly. Unless Freya can, can keep them focused on her. Alright, we did a little bit of damage there. Alright, we can definitely take that out. Can definitely take care of this one. And then this guy's got no chance. The path is clear. I mean, he'll charge us, he'll hit us, he'll hurt us a little bit, but we should be fine. Cruel blow, but not a fatal blow. Victory! Very nice. Alright, folks. The Liberators we managed to pick up, and the Bloodstained Bolts. Ranged attack. Ranged attacks bleed target. Very nice. And we got a common uh, Sigmarite Warhammer. And the Fireside laments the... Ossiarch Bone Reapers? Sure. Alright, a little bit of experience to the Castigators and to Freya. Very, very good. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, that is going to have to do it for this very first episode. I really hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, really interesting and cool looking game thus far. I I'm digging it. We'll still have to kind of figure stuff out, but it does seem like you have very limited movement and very limited range to attack and all this stuff so you really have to think about that and think it all the way through the high ground thing i like I, it's good it's a good start i like what i see so far we'll just have to see how it goes as we get a little bit further into it all right folks the name of the game once again is warhammer age of sigmar storm ground go check it out it should already be out by the time this video is released and you guys will be able to grab it and play it and enjoy if you want more information about the game where to get the game information on the developer the publisher any of that stuff down below in the description of the video and various links should be all there for you guys. Uh, like the video, subscribe if you enjoyed yourselves. And until the very next episode, I've been your host, Bumpy McSquiggums. Thank you so much for stopping by the Freak Show. Always remember, we play, we fight, we conquer. <laughs>